Hi, I'm Ava Bell, international fashion makeup artist. You can see my work at ava-bell.com. Today I'm going to show you some of the tricks of the trade and some of my makeup secrets. Today I'm going to show you how to apply blush. I've chosen a really beautiful, warm, taupey colour for my model's lovely pale skin. Something very subtle just to give her a little bit of extra colour and to warm up her face. Starting at the apples of the cheeks, we're going to move upwards, always working upwards and blending out, making sure there's no harsh lines. Tap off any excess so that you don't end up with a big splash of colour in your face. It's always easier to add more later than it is to take it away. So start small and build on that colour. Just slowly, slowly, a little bit at a time, blending it out, making sure there's never any harsh lines. You always want your makeup to look flawless and blended and smooth and like it just disappears to nothing. You don't want to see where it begins and ends. You just want it to disappear to nothing like it's just a natural little flush of colour in your cheeks. and taking it up into the temple area as well. I've chosen a very um, neutral, torpy colour today because my model skin is quite pale. The darker your skin tone, the darker you can go with your colours. If you've got very, very dark skin, you can go into really beautiful burgundy and rich um, maroons. Just depending on your skin colour, you can work with a whole range of different blushes to highlight and to enhance. Okay, now I'm going to do a little bit of highlight on the cheekbones. I'm actually um, cheating a little bit and using some eyeshadow um, as a dual purpose product and I'm going to mix a little bit of a peachy tone and a little bit of a creamy tone, blend it together and it's going to be a great highlighter. I'm just coming in on the highest part of the cheekbone, just so it picks up that light and then blending it away. So another great place to highlight is on the inside of the eye, just gives that brightness to the eye, just in the corners, a tiny little bit and also a nice little trick to make your lips look bigger, just going in with an angle brush is on the cupid's bow. Okay so always remembering to make sure that your blush is blended out beautifully and take it up into a lovely C shape, a little bit of highlighter and that's how to apply a great blush.